Yeah. Hello, everybody out there. Uh, hello to all the people who aren't out there too. I don't want to. I don't want to just do it to the. Pe I just want to say hi to people who are out there. A lot of people aren't out there and who will never hear it. Uh, I'm saying hello. Look at the yellow. I'm looking at all oh, yellow. That'd be a good one. I haven't done any Coldplay anyway. Uh, okay. I can change my, oh, that's okay. That's better. Or that one. And that one. No, no, not that. With the blue kind of light, blue kind of light, that one. Hmm. I went with this one. I think that's just a straight white light. It makes it look a little less, uh, I don't know. That was just looking uh, like a little, a little too, too much color. Like the wrong type of color, you know, like a sick or something. I uh, hope everyone's having a good time. I'm having a great time. Oh, I don't need my ads up there yet. Let me take these off here. What's that? Ba, 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 ba. Uh, so I'm having a pretty good time. I'm doing some teaching. Uh, went back, uh, taught the first comedy course of the season, the first class of that uh, last night. So that was awesome. What am I trying to turn off here? Where's my logo? There we go. There, let's get that out. I'll put that on later. Uh, oh, there's some hellos. There's some humans here. I always start like a minute or two early because, as you know, I sometimes suffer uh, technical disasters. Uh, so in case one of those happens. Uh, yeah, funny thing, like uh, when I was doing my online comedy course last night, uh, I forgot to plug my laptop in. I was running it off the battery. I didn't know that. And I spotted it like just before it was going to power down. Yeah, that would have been embarrassing. Wow. Yep. Take a few months off and I forget how technology works. Do, 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 do. Oh, Colonel Sidequest is here again. Always on a side quest. Always on a side quest. Uh, oh, let's get the multi. Sorry, I don't have my multi stream chat up here. Can't see everybody. Uh, so I'm still working on some songs for the duo, and I'm also working. What else am I doing? I found some random song. Like, I, oh my. I, you know, Spotify. If you have Spotify and you run, you run out of your playlist, it just starts giving you crap at things you might like, right? And sometimes it does. And so today I heard a song. I went, oh, I've never heard that song before that I can remember. I like that song. So I learned it just before. Well, I didn't really learn it. Because I just, this was like just an hour before now in the past. And, but I still, I looked up the chart and went, hey, I can do that. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to do that song. And then I have another cat song. I might debut today. If you're good. If you're good. If you're, if you're not, if you're naughty, I'm not going to do it. But, uh. And, oh, and I got a bunch of questions. I put the questions out. I remembered this week to ask questions on the internet, so I got some questions. Uh, so there's people showing up. That's good. Maybe I'll, should I start a? I'm gonna start a song. I'll start the the. Uh, what am I gonna? What am I gonna? Do? I'm gonna start the song that I just sort of kind of learned. Here we go. Uh, yeah, this just came up. It was just you know, just popped up on Spotify. On my, uh, the little list it makes up. The little algorithm told me I would like this song, and I liked it. And so I went, okay, I'm going to learn it. So the song is called By Way of Sorrow, and the band is Cry, Cry, Cry. And apparently it was a folk supergroup, as if that can be, as, as if that's a thing, you know. A folk supergroup in the late 90s, and they only put out one album, and this was it. Yeah, that's why I guess I had heard of them. Yeah, I like I looked usually I looked for their website, didn't have a website. Oh no, maybe they're I got a Facebook page. No Facebook page. And then I oh, okay, I see there. They just put out one album. Oh, I got the reverb on. This yeah, this is kind of this is mid tempo ballet type of thing. Okay. Anyone heard well you can tell me afterwards if anyone's heard this song before. I don't remember hearing it. You've been taken by the wind You have known the kiss of sorrow Doors that would not take you in Outcast and a stranger You have come by way of sorrow You have come by way of tears But you'll reach your destiny Meant to find you all these years Meant to find you all these years You have drunk bitter wine With none to be your comfort You who once were left behind Will be welcomed at love's table You have come by way of sorrow You 
have come by way of tears But to reach your destiny Meant to find you all these years Meant to find you all these years All the night that joy has slept Will awake to days of laughter Gone the tears that you have wept You'll dance in freedom ever after You have come by way of sorrow You have come by way of tears But you'll reach your destiny Meant to find you all these years You have come by way of sorrow You have come by way of tears But you'll reach your destiny Meant to find you all these years Meant to find you all these years There it is. Eh, just a nice song. I thought I'd sort of learn it, half learn it and play it for you. Uh, so, uh, what am I doing here? What am I doing? Oh, yeah. So, I don't know if anyone, anyone know that song? Anyone hear that song before? That's a nice song. The version on the Spotify there, I had lots of harmonies on it, which I really liked, but I can't do that all by myself because, well, not live anyway. Oh, no, you can with effects now. I can get some pedal to make harmony. Anyway, I'm not going to, I'm not going to do that. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's see what's going on here. Uh, oh yeah, Colonel was asking, where do you post? I post the questions on Facebook. Occasionally, I also post them on Twitter when I get around. Like, I I often forget that Twitter is a thing. So I sometimes do something there and sometimes not. Twitter seems to be a cranky place. People are just worked up on Twitter. So I, I try to, I just don't go there that often. You know, it's like a bar where you go, hey, lots of people are at that place. I bet that's really cool. And you get there, it's like, uh, I don't know. Um, but my Facebook page. So I have a Trevor Strong Facebook page. Uh, in addition, there's the Arrogant Worms Facebook page. Sometimes I'll we'll, I'll double post it, but not always. BJ had heard the song. Okay. Did you hear the song? Yeah, it sounds like a song that maybe a few people have played over the years anyway i like it i'm gonna sing it again sometime not not immediately on the stream but uh da, 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 i'll do it sometime uh okay we got uh, we got some attendance here what am i gonna do now oh maybe to answer some questions where am i where are my show notes here what do i have for my questions uh i'll just go in order of the questions i have kyle 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 who i think i think i saw kyle's name yeah kyle's oh kyle's asking how my cat is i'll talk about cats later kyle uh, I always talk, yeah, Kyle knows how to get me going, just putting the word cats, and uh, I'm off to the races. Um, any worm CDs in the near future? I wish I had an answer for you, Kyle. I do not. We have enough songs. We have all those songs we've done on Patreon, and we could probably pick the best ones or the ones we like best and then, you know, make them a little better, rewrite them. Uh, but it's really, because we're now, the worms have been a part-time thing for a while, it's hard to get the three of us together. For any length of time so i'd say that's the main thing i hope we do an album sometime but we'll see uh yeah sorry that's a disappointing answer um uh, if i get bored enough i'll just put out my own damn album i don't know i might do that sometime who knows who knows so yeah sorry sorry not a, not the best answer not the best answer not the best answer uh oh pat's already request okay his i am cow as uh, pat are you are you a cow That'd be awesome if we have the cows tuning in. I mean, it's a good market. It's a good market. Um, yeah, yeah, I am cow. Hello. Oh, and I uh, got a hello as well. Hello to you too. Uh, Ryan Describable. Ryan Describable. Ryan Describable. Ryan Describable. Sometimes I think people are not putting their real names on the internet. I'm just twitching into this. Like, some of these are ridiculous. Ridiculous. Like, Scott Crawford. That's not a real name. <laughs> Scott. Uh, I'm going to. I'm going to do another song, and then I'll ramble a little more. Uh, what did I have? Oh, did I do Captain Kid last week? I don't think I did, but if I, I'm going to do it again anyway. Did I do it last week? Does anyone remember? It's one of the ones I'm learning. Um, and then uh, for my duo thing that we got going. And then I think I did, I think I, I think I, did I do it last week? I don't know. I'm doing it again. I need practice because, man, I totally messed it up. Uh, Great PC does a version. I'm assuming it's a traditionally song. Maybe somebody wrote it. I don't know. 
it's got a it's got a hard chord in it. It's got a G sus four in it, which is it's this chord. I'll show you. I'll show you here. So yeah, it's been taking me a while to figure because it has this great big C songs and folk songs. It's got that chord. Look at that. Yeah, it's hard, and it just goes. Anyway. Anyway, anyone answered? Uh, da, 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 da. Uh, oh, people have people. Oh, people are just talking to each other. Okay, I saw I saw there's a whole bunch of stuff. Okay. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, I'm okay, Captain Kid. I'm supposed to learn this for my duo. We got a, we got a duo. I'm doing a duo in Kingston. We don't have any gigs yet. When we do, I'll let you know. You can all drive to Kingston and see us in some tiny little coffee house with uh, three other people there. It's much much like this streaming I do here. Actually, it'll be very similar. <laughs> Oh, get my reverb on. Here we go. Yeah, okay. Try not to screw this up too bad. My name is Captain Kidd. As I sailed, as I sailed. My name is Captain Kidd. As I sailed. My name is Captain Kidd. And God's laws I did forbid. And most wickedly I did as I sailed. My father taught me well. To shun the gates of hell But against him I rebelled As I sailed He shoved a Bible in my hand But I left it in the sand And I pulled away from land As I sailed My name is Captain Kidd As I sailed, as I sailed My name is Captain Kidd As I sailed My name is Captain Kidd And God's laws I did forbid And most wickedly I did as I sailed I, will, I murdered William Moore And I left him in his gore Twenty leagues away from shore As I sailed And being crueler still The gunner I did kill And his precious blood did spill As I sailed My name is Captain Kidd As I sailed, as I sailed My name is Captain Kidd As I sailed My name is Captain Kidd And God's laws I did forbid and most wickedly I did as I sailed I was sick a night to death And I bowed at every breath Oh, to walk him Williams past as I sailed But my pence did last it not My vows I soon forgot Oh, damnation is my lot as I sailed My name is Captain Kidd As I sailed, as I sailed My name is Captain Kidd as I sailed my name is Captain Kidd, and God's laws I did forbid, and most wickedly I did as I sailed. To the execution dock, lay my head upon the block, nor's more no will I mock as I sailed. So take warning here and heed, to shun bad company, or you'll wind up just like me as I sailed. My name is Captain as I sailed, as I sailed, my name is Captain Kidd, as I sailed. My name is Captain Kidd, and God's laws I did forbid, and most wickedly I did as I sailed. Or something like that. I did better that time than the last time I played it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Surprisingly, uh, it's the words in that one. You got to get them in the right spot, else it just doesn't sound good. Anyway, I think I did better. I did better. I give myself a B, maybe a B minus. B or B minus. I'm gonna get better. I'll be better. When you come see the duo, when you're one of the one of the three people in the audience watching us, you'll go, "Hey, Trevor got a lot better at that song." Yeah, yeah. That's what you're gonna do. That's what you're gonna do. That's yeah. I, I wasn't really familiar with. I must. There were two great big C albums that I CDs that I had and I played to death and I know all the songs on those like to hear it but I, I that must have been on a one i didn't have anyway anyway kevin in the in in our duo he wanted he liked that one i said yeah i know all the cat i, I know i know all the creepy sea songs and he played it like i don't know that one i don't mm, i'm wrong I thought i knew them all i don't bum, 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 bum. let's see what's going on in the chat so if you haven't been here before uh, this is just me basically practicing whatever i feel like uh occasionally uh, if i run if i run out of stuff i feel like doing i will take a request but only if i feel like it just so you know uh, i do a monthly zoom show 
a concert where you can come and uh, it's it's all request and then i will do your request mm -hmm. that's that's the upsell that's how I'm, I'm trying to upsell people to go to the concerts because then i'll actually play something you might like okay uh, let's take a look at the, I'll okay, go back to the questions. See if what, and you can ask questions in the stream, by the way, I just don't always catch them. Uh, but you can ask a question right here. I just found that asking questions before the, the show is, is it works better. Cause then I have questions for sure. And you guys aren't like all stressed out going, ah, no one's asking Trevor a question. Look at him. He's making me feel uncomfortable cause he's got nothing to talk about. Uh, okay. Let's go to the next question. Oh, next question is from Carolyn. I don't think she's she usually shows up a little later. Should I? I'm gonna I'm gonna leave this one. I'll do do that one later if I remember. Uh, is 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 Mr. Michael Stryker here yet? He's not here yet either. He usually comes later as well. Maybe I'll, uh, Geneva's here. A lot of people aren't haven't shown up yet. Uh, I'll do Paul. Paul's question. Paul Nussbaum. I don't think he usually comes, but I think he might watch them later. So Paul asks. Paul asks. Ever consider doing a show? or brackets, or did you, at the Mounted Animal Nature Trail, a.k.a. Gordon's Park. Uh, we have, we did do a show at the Mounted Animal Nature Trail long, long time ago. Uh, must be 20 years ago. We did play the Mounted Animal Tra Nature Trail. It's true. It's true. And um, we, uh, we enjoyed all the sights. They also had a, uh, a miniature golf course at the time. It was the world's hardest miniature golf course um because you know most courses like if you have something like a hole that's up right you'll it'll there'll be a ramp but they didn't do that they just put like two by fours and then a platform so you'd have to kind of like chip the ball over like the, in mini golf which is difficult because the mini golf isn't supposed to work that way no it you're yeah it's not you know you don't have a chipper in mini golf anyway so that was also fun uh so yeah we did a concert i think i have vague recollections of it i think it went all right i think did we do it outside we might have done it outside outside yeah unfortunately by that time most of the animals had been moved inside um i guess there were some issues with leaving dead animals outside or something i don't know i don't know i don't know i don't know uh let me take a look here and look look what i had in my desk i think this was from last year when i did a some show one free admission to the Mounted Animal Nature Trail. Yeah, we, they gave us a whole whack of these. We'll never be able to use them now because it's closed. It's closed. It's, look at that. Look at all those. See all those? Just wasted. Just wasted. Look at that. Woo -woo. Maybe if we ever do do another album, we do some crowdfunding, maybe we'll. this will be one of those things you could get. Autographed free admission to the Mounted Animal Nature Trail. Warning does not actually provide one free admission. Uh, it was for sale, I think, a year and a half. Sometime during COVID, they they sold it, uh, so it's no longer the Mountain Animal Major Trail. It's some I think it's still some camping thing or something, but it, yeah, yeah. There you go, there, Paul. I don't know if you're here, Paul. I don't think Paul's here, but anyway, maybe he'll watch it later. Maybe he'll watch it later. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, oh, look at that! I, Carl Sidequist just gave me a tip. That's nice. Oh, and a heartfelt message with it. Trevor among the top three best worms. That's awesome. That's awesome. I'm in the top three. And that means a lot because we've actually had multiple members over the years, right? So I'm doing pretty well. I'm better than somebody. Probably somebody who quit early on. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I'll, anything else going on? Oh, uh, Colonel, uh, uh, yeah, I think we drove a lot of business to Mount Animal Nature Trail. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, okay. I did a little talking. I should probably do a song. Uh, I haven't done a comedy one yet. Well, I mean, I did uh, the 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 Captain Kid one. Is it's you know it's rollicking. It's not a comedy song, but it's, it was a rollicking song. Let's see what uh, if I had anything I wanted to do that was actually calm. Oh, maybe I'll do the cat song now. My latest cat song. Maybe I'll do that. Uh, here we go. Where we are? Here we are. I hope you guys like this one because I'm really proud of it. Uh, I think this one's going to be a big hit for me. Uh, so my latest project is too many songs about cats. I'm going to be posting one cat song a month on Patreon. Uh, I haven't decided. I've got a couple I could choose from for this month. I just have to find time to record. I will before the end of the month. Uh, so if you want to hear the, the final product, but I, I'm, I'll be trying them out whenever I got one kind of half written on this stream just to see how they work. 
see if people are digging them or not. So here's here's one here. Okay, okay, got it. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Big hit. This is gonna be a massive hit. I think this is gonna it's gonna be my retirement song. Not the royalties of this one. Sitting down for breakfast, got my bowl and my cereal. I got my spoon in my hand, man, I'm ready to go. But suddenly, all I can see is the back end of my kitty. Hey, hey, the, hey, hey, no, oh, hey, hey, there's, oh, God. Hey, hey, there's a butt in my face, which my cat has decided I should embrace. Hey, 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 there's a butt in my face. Hey, hey, there's a butt in my face, a little pink star out in fluffy space. Hey, 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 there's a butt in my face. If I'm reading, if I'm working, if I'm busy on my laptop, not long till I'm staring eye to eye with his bum cyclops I love him I do you know it's true but I prefer the parts that do not poo hey hey there's a butt in my face which my cat has decided I should embrace hey 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 there's a butt in my face hey hey there's a butt in my face a little pink star out in fluffy space hey 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 there's a button. Don't want to call him an asshole. But that's the only side of him I've really gotten to know. Hey, hey, there's a butt on my face, which my cat has decided I should embrace. Hey, 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 there's a butt on my face. Hey, hey, there's a butt in my face A little pink star out in fluffy space Hey, hey, hey There's a butt in my face There you go. There you go, future hit. Uh, I'm pretty sure Justin Bieber might want to cover that. Yeah. Yeah. Butt in my face. Big guy's gonna, that's gonna blow the doors wide open for me. That is gonna, that's that's the hit right there. That's the hit right there. Yeah. Oh, I got some woos. I got a yay. Okay, good, good. I was hoping that one would go over. I, that was so far, how many of, I did one last week, which I liked, but I didn't, it wasn't hit material. It was like definitely filler, the one I did last week. But this one here, I think, it might be a lead-off single, maybe second single. Maybe I'll outdo myself and have one even better. Uh, yeah, I'm still working on party with the party with a cat. I haven't quite figured that one out. I got a good chorus, but I yeah, haven't nailed haven't quite nailed it. And then too many songs about cats. I think that's pretty. It's solid. I might be able to do that one soon. Uh, a little pink star in fluffy space. Someone like that. That's good. You. Uh, I spent about an hour on that on that line reworking it yeah just so you know it this isn't easy for me like that just doesn't come naturally a little pink star in fluffy space i knew i had to have the word space in there and i wanted the star in there somehow yeah it took me an hour to get that line working right just yeah that's you know it's sweat you know this is yeah, it's like fame and this is where you start paying in sweat that's what i was sweating over that because i knew that line had to be it's like, oh, that's the line. That's the line. I got to work on it. And I, yeah, took me forever. Not forever, an hour. But for me, that is a lot of work. That's a lot of work for me. Anyway. Uh, uh, okay, we're moving along. Moving right along. I got a couple more questions. I'll answer another question here. Uh, even if they're not here. I gave everyone time to show up. Oh, Carolyn's a... Was she? No, no, she's not right. So, Kara, uh, Carolyn, Carolyn, frequent, uh, f frequently here, not here yet. She'll probably pop up just after I answer her question. Uh, if you had one message for your fans, what would it be? I don't know. Uh, thank you. I think it'd be thank you. It's not a very long answer, though, is it? 
I would be thank you. Like, I don't have any other... Don't go into musical comedy. That would be my second message, maybe. Uh, but the first one would just be thanks. Yeah. Oh, Alan's there. Alan M. Johnson. Another made-up name, if I've ever seen one. Uh, hello. Hello, Alan. Good. Thanks for coming. Thanks for dropping by. Uh, oh, and... Oh, okay. <laughs> Jude Dude. Uh, Jude Dude is watching from um, 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 the YouTube. Like, I, I do the Maltese stream. I don't know where people like to hang out. So I just, uh, here's a joke. Who is the best? It feels like I've gotten one of those, like, remember when you get that gum and they used to have that ridiculous cartoon? It's this kind of feeling. It's like, uh, who is the best keeper on the vegetable soccer team? The broccoli. <laughs> Yeah, that's a good one. The broccoli. Yeah, maybe I should remember that line for before the vegetable song next time. Chris tries to introduce it, and then I'll stop him, and I'll do that joke. Yeah, he'd hate that. He would just hate that. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, oh, did I, yeah, I did that. Yeah, thanks. Thanks to whoever, to my fans. How may, however, uh, a dozen of you there are. Uh, okay, do a song. Let's do a song. Let's see what else I had on my little list for today. So I did that one, and I did that one. Uh, I did that one. Oh, I'll do a worm song. I'm in a group called the Ari Worms, in case anyone. Sometimes it's easy to forget when I do these streams, because I, I, I do a few worm songs in these, but not a ton. Uh, and when I do do them, I do usually do the obscure ones, like this one here, Killer Robots, which I do, I've done occasionally. Uh, it is one of my favorite worm songs. It is not one of the favorite arrogant worm songs of the general public. Uh, when I wrote this, I wrote this with John Wittick, who was one of the original worms, and then he bailed because he wanted uh, a job, life, income, all those crazy things, right? Not sleeping on people's floors. I don't know what was wrong with that guy. I don't know what that guy's problem was. Uh, we wrote the song at the end of it. We were like, oh, my God, this is the most hilarious song ever written. Everyone is going to love this song. This is the best song. So awesome song. So good. And we started playing it, and people were kind of like, yeah, okay. Can you play the pirate song now? It's like, ah. Oh. I mean, everyone's being polite with this song. But... About six months ago, this guy came by with a petition Said we want to stop the folks moving in next door I refused to sign and told them everyone was welcome Cause that's what neighborhoods are for So they moved in and I'll admit they look peculiar But they invited me to a friendly barbecue I'm glad I got to know them and let me tell you something They may be metallic But they're just like me and you No, there's nothing wrong With killer robots and Venus They gave me zucchini From the garden yesterday, yeah No, there's nothing wrong With killer robots and Venus You may disagree But I think they're okay My buddy Charlie never got off the robot's backs Then one day, him and his whole house just disappeared I talked about it to my neighbors, the killer robots from Venus They couldn't help me, but agreed that it was weird No, there's nothing wrong with killer robots from Venus They applauded for me, oh, and they found the PTA, there it is no, there's nothing wrong with killer robots and Venus You may disagree, but I think they're okay we Had us over for an outdoor New Year's party Though it was ten below, there was food and drink aplenty We got excited as we counted down with them And when we kissed them, our lips stuck to their I was watching the news last night and I saw something funny. Killer robots from somewhere decimated Montreal. I wondered, could it be my neighbors? The killer robots from Venus. 
Could it be them after all? No, they're so nice. No, there's nothing wrong with killer robots and Venus. They applauded for my kid at the Christmas play. Yeah, no, there's nothing wrong with killer robots and Venus. You may disagree, but I think they're a-okay. You may disagree, but I think they're a-okay. You may disagree, but I think they're a-okay. Killer Robots are Venus. Not a hit. Not a hit. Not even by arrogant worm standards. And our standards are... They're low. Low. Very low for hits. Very low. How low can you go? Uh, let's check what's going on in the... Uh, let's go on with the chat here. Um, oh, da, da, da. oh, some people saying good. Uh, okay, yeah, that's weird. Mm, 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 mm. Uh, oh, uh, Kyle. Kyle had a question. How long does it take to write a song, or does it vary? The answer is yes. Uh, yeah, it, uh, it, it varies. Totally varies. Some songs are written quickly. Some aren't. Uh, Last Sketch from Pirate was written. In, we wrote that in under an hour. Maybe 45 minutes wrote that one. Other songs, Kill, uh, oh, Kill the Dog Next Door, for example. Uh, I had most of it written in a, pretty quickly, but it took me four years to finish it. So that one took a long time. Uh, yeah, it's all, some of them are quick and some of them are long. And it, there's no, uh, I wrote, there's one song I wrote faster than it can actually be played. And that was Stupid Song. I wrote that in 30 seconds. It was pretty easy to write. Yeah. So that's my record. I wrote a song in less time than it takes to play it. So that was, you know. Uh, but yeah, it, it can vary. Um, a lot of times I'll get like three quarters of a way through a song and then I'll get stuck on something. So like the the uh, the button my face song, I got stuck on that one line, like I said, for an hour because I knew it had to work. But it was really hard to put all the syllab syllables in and still have my gag of the star being in like outer space but with fur. Because that's a lot to put in one line. So it took me a long time. A long time. That's, you know, when you have a word like uh, face and you have to rhyme, you, you set yourself up that you have to rhyme with it, you kind of limit your options, right? So face, space, grace. Uh, like, you know, there's some, uh, but yeah. So anyway, lot, yeah, good question. Good question. Great variation. Great deal of variation. So I've never known. I have no idea. But what? Oh, I have. I don't think I can answer this. Spring returning has asked, uh, asked a hard question. I don't know. I, mm. What line or song are you most proud? Of? Oh, see, what's what song am I most proud of writing? Oh, I don't know. Jeez, I don't because uh, it changes. I'm usually happy, proudest of the most recent song until I find out that people don't really like it that much. Because it usually like, ah, I wrote another song and it's like ah. Uh, uh but so what song i mean i'm i'm proudest for happiest for the last saskatchewan pirate song because it's gone off and it's left the home has its own life has been covered like i don't know how many times 10 times anyway maybe more than that now uh so that's nice for that song so uh what am i proudest of? oh geez i can't even and what line i'd have to think about that i because there definitely are lines i'm proud of but i'm offhand mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm having trouble I'm having trouble with that one if anyone wants to put their favorite line that they think I might have written that'd be fine and then it can jog my memory because there, uh, there's got to be something I like got to be that was a hard question that was a stumper right there that was a stumper jeez I should have ignored that sometimes I look over and I go ah oh, I can't answer that I should have just I don't have my time machine with me, unfortunately. It wouldn't matter, because if you had the time machine, you could always just bring it back whenever you needed it. So therefore, you now know I don't have a time machine. Yeah. Damn, it's out. Uh, da -da -da. Oh, Carolyn's here! Already asked your... I answered your your question, Carolyn, already. I didn't mean to. I, I put it off for a little while, and then I just did it. Yeah. So you're going to have to go back and watch it later, I guess. Uh, and then you missed a stumper. Yeah, I was just... It was... Ah! And it's bugging me because I know I must have a favorite line, but I can't think of what it is. 
Mm. It's going to... Okay, uh, you know what? I'm going to stew on my own after the stream. You shouldn't have to watch me sit and stew thinking uh, for that long. Oh, I haven't done a Tom Petty song yet. Okay. Doing my... I try to do a Tom Petty song every stream. I think there was one stream where I didn't by accident. I just forgot that that's one of my self-imposed laws. I've done this one before, but I like it. Uh, this was never a single. I do this one a lot... Uh, I do this one a lot in jams, like if I'm in a folk jam or something like that, or playing songs with other people around. It's the same three chords all the way around. So if you have a, a ukulele or a guitar or a piano nearby, it's just G, C, and D. Those are the chords. And the whole song is this. That's it. That's the whole song. So you can go, go, I'll vamp for a bit. You can go grab your instrument and play along with Trevor. Maybe that'll be my next failed business play along with trevor it eh, sounds dodgy doesn't it sounds dodgy i wouldn't send my kid to play along with trevor i would not do that now that, now that i'm listening to what i just said trevor blew in Cold, dark wind came with that no warning. A big old house went up for sale on the road by morning. Oh, 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 the days grow cold into the changing season. Oh, 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 rather wrong reasons, yeah. Well, she grew up higher and she grew up fast in the age of television. She made a vow to have it all. It became her new religion Ah, oh, down in her soul Was an act of treason Ah, oh, down they go begins, the horizon ends, despite the best intentions, a big old man goes up for sale, he becomes his own invention, oh, oh, oh the days go cold, into the changing seasons, oh, oh, oh and soul for all the wrong reasons oh, 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 down they go to do it's all the wrong reasons oh which album was that off of uh, I can't remember I can't remember Ah, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, you get to hear one that I, I know because I played that song. It's good for me to at least occasionally give you a song that I actually know how to how to play. Uh, wow, there's a lot going on in the chat. Jeez, what happened there? Uh, okay, just seeing. Oh, people mostly talk to each other, so... Uh, oh, somebody has a favorite... Really tired. Shut up. Have a different audience in the way. Oh, someone likes the Mount of Able Chair where we tell the audience to shut up. Yeah, well, I enjoy that too. That's very, uh, uh, that's very enjoyable telling uh, to tell an audience to shut up. <laughs> and they paid you good money and then you're insulting them. I, I always enjoy that as well. Mm -hmm. 
Do 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 do. Yep. Uh, okay. I'm almost through all the songs I want to do. So, I want to do there any more? No, I did that one. Oh, I was gonna do this one. Got another cover I want to do. But then after that, I think we have time. If so, if you have a couple. Oh, I haven't talked about my cats yet. I was asked earlier about my cats, and then I had another question I wanted to answer instead. My cats are doing fine. Uh, I keep on getting more cats. So I have my cats, Andy and Marcel, and, and then fostering a cat called Meowie. Uh, I did not name Meowie, by the way. Uh, we've been calling Meowie M because I don't think we're allowed to change a foster cat's name, but I can't really say Meowie. So it's the letter M. So we're just saying M. That's our kind of, I don't know, our little dodge on that. Uh, and Meowie's doing great. When we got her, she was uh, skinny, skinny, and we fattened her up. And now she's got tons of energy to run around. Uh, she's having a great time. So Meowie's doing well. And now we have a backyard cat, a backyard cat. So this cat was kind of wandering around. And then I, uh, and then the cat started yelling at me, going, rawr, rawr, rawr. and so I, being a cat person, understood that that cat was giving me orders and I didn't understand what it was asking for. And I went, well, that cat probably wants food or pats. And being a cat, it's almost definitely food. So I gave it some food and it came over and then I ate some food and then it went rawr, rawr, rawr at me and then it wanted pats. So then I gave it pats. And now it's been hanging out with us for about three days. Uh, so we just posted about it. Hopefully some, hopefully it's someone's cat and they'll come get it. We hope. And if not, we'll have to, I guess, take it some, take it to get scanned or whatever. So I'm getting all the cats. I am rich in cats. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, if wealth was measured in cats, I have doubled my wealth in the last couple of weeks. Yep. Yep. You're going to, yeah, I'll be that guy who, you know, People come in, he's been dead for a month, no one knew it, and there's just cats in the house, right? That's going to be me. And, but you know what? I'm actually looking forward to that fate. That is like my my preferred fate. Yep, yeah, right there, right there. Anyway, so, but the cats, all four of them seem to be fine. I'm up to four. I really have two, and then one that's in, allowed to be in our house and one that's just kind of decided it was going to live in our backyard. Yep. Do, do, do. So there we go. That was the, the cat update, the cat update. Yeah, they always want something. Sometimes you can't figure out. This one has a great voice. Yeah, I like cats that talk. I I like the yappy ones. Uh, oh, I was gonna do this one. Okay, here we go. Not by request. I did this at my. This was, this was requested though at my. Uh, it was really strange. This was requested at my last Zoom uh, concert all request zoom concert this was requested so i i and it was one i had meant to i'm meaning to play for years it's, it's a cover song by the way it's not a comedy one uh but i but it was one i've gone oh i should learn that and then the very next day when i met uh with kevin who we're going to make the duo with and he sent he gave me his list of songs he wanted to do this was on it this is one of the songs he wanted to do and i was like hey i just i just played that song for the first time ever and he was like that's great good I think the conversation sounded no. That was probably about the conversation. Sometimes you know it sounds. You go. This is gonna sound awesome when I say this. So everyone, most people should know this song. Today is gonna be the day that I'm gonna throw it back to you. By now you should have somehow realized what you gotta do I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you now Backbeat, the word is on the street that the fire in your heart is out I'm sure you heard it all before but you never really had a doubt I don't believe there's anybody feels the way I do about you now And all the roads we have to walk are winding And all the lights that lead us there are blinding There are many things I would like to say to you But I don't know how Because maybe You're gonna be the one that saves me And after all Today is gonna to be.
be the day, but they'll never throw it back to you. By now, you should have somehow realized what you're not to do. I don't believe that anybody feels the way I do about you now. And now the roads that lead you there are winding. And now the lights are light the way I'm blinding. There are many things I would like to say to you, but I don't know how. Said maybe you're gonna be the one that saves me. And after all, you're my wonder wall. I said maybe. Gonna be the one that saves me And after all You're my wonder one uh, That one's called Wonderwall mm -hmm. Wonderwall Wonderwall, Wonderwall You're my Wonderwall Wonderwall, Wonderwall, Wonderwall that's not how it goes. That's not how it goes. Uh, I've got I got time for a couple more songs. Uh, yeah, I got I might check out a little early because I have to find Backyard Cat. Backyard Cat comes twice a day, and somebody wants to go and see if it's their backyard cat, their cat. So I got to go catch Backyard Cat, which is easy because the cat likes to be picked up, which is mm -hmm, makes me think not feral, not feral, not feral. Uh, so if anyone wants uh, you can put in a request now I'll find something uh, but if somebody if somebody has one that you know I already know and you want to hear uh, new song Backyard Cat yeah Backyard Cat might be a new song you're right you're right yeah just looking 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 uh, I think someone asked for a cow earlier I can do cow I'll do cow I'll do cow I don't know if that person's still around or not though I think they might have bailed. I think they were like, I want, I want cow. And they're like, nah, he's not playing it. I'm not playing it. Uh, da, da, da. But uh, I am cow. I'll do I am cow. I just gotta, yeah, it's fine. I am cow, written by the great, uh, the great Mike McCormick uh, in the group called The Arrogant Worms. Uh, it's a Mike song. As I've mentioned, almost every time I sing this song, uh, the, uh, when Mike uh, pitched this for... We were doing some album, and we're bringing in the songs we had. Uh, he originally had four verses, four verses, and I, uh, I, I said, I think, I think the song's great, but I don't think it needs four verses. So you can cut one of them. So out there somewhere is the lost "I Am Cow" verse. By the way, it's out there. I don't know where. I don't even know what it was. I only heard it once. So sing along if you know it. I sort of know it. I really only know the last verse because that's all I ever sing in the worms. I am cow, hear me moo. I weigh twice as much as you. I look good on the barbecue. Your good curd cream cheese and butters made from liquid from my udders. I am cow, I am cow, hear me moo. That's kind of your part. I do that when we're doing it live, but I can't because I'm singing the other stuff now. All right, so you, this should, there should be lowing throughout the next verse. So you can fill that in for yourself. I am cow eating grass, methane gas comes out my ass. Out my muscle when I belch For oh, the ozone layer's thinner From the outcome of my dinner I am cow, I am cow I've got gas I am cow, here I stand Far and wide upon this land I am living everywhere From BC to Newfoundland You can squeeze my teats by hand I am cow I am cow, I am cow, I am cow, I am cow, I am cow. I am cow. 
I am Cal. Oh, I forgot to throw the reverb around. There we go. Uh, so I think I'll answer another question or two, and then I'll do one last song. I don't know what that song is yet, but I'll I'll do. Not seeing any other songs in the, so far that I know how to play. It has to be a song I can just quickly play and already know. Um, oh, Mentor's talking about the History Channel, about finding the lost verse of I Am Count. That would be good. Or it would be one of those those podcasts that go on forever, but we will solve the mystery. There was once heard that there was a fourth verse to I Am Cow. Many people said this was just rumor, but this podcast seeks to find the truth. We could do one of those, drag it out for like 20 episodes right 20 episodes you know talking to people what's your relationship to mike mccormick i don't know the guy you know stuff like that yeah we were no closer but yet we still kept on i don't know that was anyway uh oh canada goose i might do canada goose yeah i'll do canada goose i'll do that at the end so i'm just gonna see if Go back to my little show. Oh, I haven't, I haven't pushed it. I don't, what do I have to push? I'm doing the uh, song in an hour thing sometime soon. Go to my website. So you can join me and we'll write a song together in an hour. And at the end, uh, then I'll just record it and send it to everyone. But you get to participate in writing a song. Uh, yeah, I really should have had the link ready. Just go to trevorstrong.org.org, not com. Somebody else had that. Trevorstrong.org, it's on there. Or if you go to the Area Worms event page, it'll be on that too. Uh, write a song with Trevor. Yeah, so that's coming up. Uh, is it a week from this Sunday, maybe? I should have, probably should have checked that. Anyway, I think it's a week from this Sunday. Or maybe two. I don't know. It's coming up. That's my next big thing. And uh, I can always use more patrons to keep me writing more, more cat songs. Eventually, I'll do a different thing than cat songs, but that's my current thing. Uh, da, 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 da. Oh, I was gonna see if there's any more questions in my little, my little, my little show notes here. Did I? Uh, da, 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 da. I think I answered most of them. I think I did. Oh, Michael. Michael had a question. He, didn't, he wasn't able to show up today, unfortunately. I don't think. Uh, uh, why is it that I'm? Con- this is Michael talking. I think it's in the first person. Why is it I'm considered a hero if I donate a kidney, but all of a sudden I'm a monster if I donate two or more? That's an interesting question. Um, I think it's because of the implications of having multiple kidneys available. There's there's really only... Well, there's a couple of possible explanations. So if you donate one kidney, okay? If you donate two kidneys, most people die. So perhaps people might think you're a zombie or some form of undead or some uh, maybe an alien being that was impersonating a human and just assumed the human shape and then didn't really need the kidneys. Uh, uh, now, if you donate more than two kidneys, then you then there's real trouble. So then you've already you're either taking them from other people, which I think is frowned upon in our society. That's frowned upon, isn't it? I think that's frowned upon. Uh, you're taking them from other people, which is bad. It's a bad thing. So if you're doing this, Michael, you, I would just you should stop soon, like now, stop doing that. The or you have regenerative. Well, you might have more than maybe you have twenty kidneys. And that's not good either. Or maybe you uh, regenerate kidneys once you remove them. Maybe you regenerate. Maybe you, re- you regenerate all parts of your body. I don't know. So maybe you have some sort of superpower. But that's also unusual. That's all. That's all. That one's probably the best scenario. If you can actually just regenerate kidneys. So there you go. Phew, I'm glad I answered that question. Okay. So hope hope you can rest easy tonight. Canada Goose. I haven't done this one in a little while. Canada Goose. Canada. So I've got a Patreon, and the Arian Worms also have a Patreon. We put this off on the Arian Worms Patreon a while ago. Do I? I might even. I had it memorized for a while there. Do I still have it memorized? Oh, ah, I got my cheat chart just in case. Just in case, because I don't think I've actually played this in in quite a while. Uh, I, I was playing it all the. I was playing a lot because I really like this one of the new songs I've written. This is right up there with butt in my face. I just think it's actually probably a little better. Okay, so thanks everyone for coming along. Have a good, uh, have a good weekend, and I'll see you next week. Oh, well, I'm gonna sing this song first. You don't have to leave yet, by the way. It kind of sounded like I was kicking you out, but I got another song to play. In Canada, the dollar coin features the lovely loon. Whose sweet and soaring singing voice makes everybody swoon. 
But it's just so damn dull and nice Makes us look like a bore It's time we celebrate a bird You cannot ignore Canada Goose The bird without fear Canada Goose The cobra chicken's here And it says hold my beer It's already got Canada right there in its name But we always seem to treat it with distrust and disdain We talk of beaver, bear, and moose But what else can you name? That'll beat you up, spit on your kid Then take out a jet plane Canada Goose Pluralizes using vowels Canada geese Put the fowl in water Fowl Green pellets fall from their bowels Unloose the goose Unleash the geese Who bite you without tooth or teeth And forsooth They are at least as dangerous As a moose Or a whole herd of Meese. And as the evening light bathes the land in red, you'll hear the plaintive call of Shog, 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 as it bites you on the head, Canada Goose. The true bird strong and free, Canada Goose. Let's ditch the loony and say hello to the goonie. There you go, Canada, Canada Goose, Canada Goose. Oh, I forgot to tell you how to give me money if you wanted to. Oh, I don't, yeah, probably too late. Oh, here's my logo. There you go. Just in case, you can go to paypal.me slash Trevor the Worm. Yeah, you go, or you could bank thingy to trevstrong at gmail.com. Uh, well, thanks, everyone, uh, for coming out. Uh, hopefully, see you next week or some other week, or you can always watch these go these go up on the YouTube and the Twitch and the Faith, Facebook. It just automatically goes there. So you can always catch them later if you really want to. Especially if you so put a question in sometime and you can just watch it, you know, have your question an answered at your leisure. At your leisure in the comfort of your own home. Actually, you're already probably mostly in your own home. Anyway, okay. Okay, I'm going to wave goodbye. And I'm going to press that button. And then I'm going to look for my backyard cat. Okay, everyone, have a good, uh, good time. See you all later.